Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters. I'm at the Mecca Center and I met a sleep physician and he shared something just really amazing with me, a latest discovery about sleeping on your side. Can you share that with us? Yeah, so subhanAllah, as we know, the Prophet وسلم, told us that it, the best body position for sleep is to sleep on the right side. So the sunnah of the Prophet وسلم, is to uh, sleep on the right side. And now it has been proven scientifically by people who are non-Muslims, by American scientists, uh, that sleeping on the right side Sleeping on the side, especially the right side, is the healthiest position for sleep. It especially the right side. Especially the right side. And that's in Islam. That's yeah. what the Prophet Muhammad he uh, expressed, right? Absolutely, in his, absolutely, the absolutely. The Hadith tells us to sleep on the right side, and the uh, science also proves this. And uh, two things um, have have been shown. One is there is this condition called sleep apnea, and it tends to be worse when people sleep on their back. So when, the, when one sleeps on the side. It's less likely to happen, especially the right side. Uh, the other thing is, there's this, we have discovered recently that there's a system in the brain that clears, uh, gets rid of wastes that accumulates during the day. And the best position, but the position during sleep is, is to sleep on the right side and that helps, that enables the system to get rid of all this waste that accumulate during the day. So this is what we have found out so far, but who knows, there may be other things that science in the future will, will prove. Um, subhanallah, everything that we read in the Quran, everything that we read in the Sunnah, when something comes out in science, it proves that the Quran and the Sunnah are from the, uh, the Quran is authentic and the, and the Hadith from the Prophet is also an accurate Sunnah. Um, there's so many things that science proves and we see the origin of it in the Quran. Um, and, and another thing that we, we have learned is if somebody uses the, the mouth and, and throat muscles, that helps protect from uh, sleep apnea also. And as we know, in, in, uh, in Islam, we encourage people to read the Quran, to uh, practice a tajweed. And tajweed uses pretty much every muscle in the throat and in the mouth. It strengthens these muscles and also helps uh, 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 protect the body from this condition that can affect breathing during sleep and is uh, during sleep and is, is, is detrimental to health. So subhanallah, there's a lot of things. Uh, Thank you for sharing those few gems with us. Yeah, no problem. Uh, there's a lot of things, and uh, subhanallah, we just have to look carefully. We have to look at the sunnah and look at science, and there was no, there's no contradiction between the two. Absolutely. Thank you, brother. No, no problem. Alaikum salam. We've been told that uh, they're out to kill us all. Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters. We went to the streets to ask Americans about Islam. Here's what they said. Do you know anything about Islam? No. Do you know anything about Islam? No, sadly. Do you know anything about Islam? Uh, not really. Do you know anything about Islam? No, I'm sorry. <laughs> Do you know what Islam means? Islam? Uh, no. We've been told that uh, they're out to kill us all. That's what you've been told? That Muslims are out to kill you all. Well, that's what they say on TV. Anything. I know it's in the Middle East, isn't it? Well, then you're going to have four wives. Brothers and sisters, as you can see, there are so many Americans who don't know about Islam. We need your help to change that. Help us to build the Dean Center, the first mega dawah center in America. Click the donate right now. May God Almighty Allah reward all of you. قال رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم من بنى لله مسجدا ولو كمفحص قطات بنى الله له بيتا في الجنة تخيل أن تكون سببا في إنشاء مركز إسلامي في قلب أمريكا بمساحة خمسة وثلاثين ألف قدم تخيل أن تكون سببا لأن يسجد الخلق بين يدي الخالق وأن تكون بتوفيق الله سببا في تعرف الآلاف على الإسلام ودخول الكثيرين في دين الله ما أجمل أن تكون لك صدقة جارية يتعلم في ظلها المسلم الجديد مبادئ الدين ويجد فيها الشباب المسلم بيئة آمنة جاذبة تعينه على الاستمساك بإسلامه الداعية الأمريكي إيدي هو من يشرف بنفسه على هذا المشروع الدعوي الفريد بعد أن قدم مئات الحلقات وملايين المشاهدات عبر اليوتيوب خذ من وقتك دقيقتين وساهم بما تستطيع في هذا المشروع العظيم